Let's talk about, about Rodgers first because I think okay, because he's technically weird. not even traded there, and it's like the situation is just funny insane. because he's like, yeah, this is the these are the players that you got to get me. They're getting these players. Can and you, just, oh, you go out there. <laughs> yeah, I'll get it. Rodgers and Harden are on the same level of heated conversation. No, I'm saying this thing was about to start. Like he was yeah. ready to go in. He was ready to go. <laughs> yeah, I was like, game. Right, go ahead. Go he ahead. caught himself. He caught himself that time. He so fast to put the meat in his he, mouth. He probably knows this guy's. Well, what was he about to do? What was he about to say? He can spell it out. I think that's the social security <laughs> number. He knows Rodgers. <laughs> he knows Rodgers. I mean, Aaron Rodgers said that he didn't say that shit. But he told me. Basically, he told me he's going to New York. He's like outside his house with binoculars. What are you doing? Rogers, what are you doing? <laughs> All right, go ahead. Man. He, go he ahead. told the Jets again, correct me after I say this <laughs> yeah. if I'm wrong, because you know, uh, he told the Jets these are the players that I want. A lot of it is basically motherfuckers that play for the Packers. <laughs> yeah, um, I'm like, uh, and, and you just stay. Just trade the rest and of the he's Packers. Making you his stay, whole, like, decision thing. Like, he's doing, he thinks he's that nice that he's got to do ESPN. I got to go on Pat McAfee's podcast, say, I came out the woods and I had a revelation. I'm ready I to like play again. Man, I'm playing for the Jets. Like, you're not good enough to warn all that. Mean, he's I'm best, sorry. He's the best. Yeah. Packer of all time. Okay. Is he not? He's a four time MVP. It's just tough though. You know Come what? Fra- Aaron Rodgers. <laughs> he's he's Brady don't even do that, that shit. Shiver me timbers. Bro, Brady don't moves. even be doing, doing that shit. It's the team's fault. It's not the QB's fault. No, no, Brady don't, don't even be doing okay, that shit. Two different people. But you no, know, bro, but one, you, one of them has better stats. One of them has more okay, rings. But you know they're piling on a QB, right? When the team loses, if the QB takes all the blame. Well, if you watch football, you know that's not what how it goes, bro. Like every single freaking match. That's what The special team sold them. He missed a field goal and then the apartment turned I don't But you can't act like he was lighting it up though. He wasn't, but he was playing enough good enough to win. Yeah, but I don't think no. if you're you not lighting it up sure. and that shit happens, they're gonna get on your ass. They're gonna get on your ass for sure. You shouldn't be doing that. I'm about shit on every chance I get. Acting like that is kind of wild. Jordan Love era. He wants people to fucking massage his balls when he does. Talk to him, bro. Hey, but is he not that guy? Is he not that guy? Is he not nice? Is he not nice? That's my point. Okay, bro. Brady's nicer than you. Mahomes is nicer than you. Hurts right now is nicer than you. Okay, Mahomes. These motherfuckers don't want their balls massaged. Josh Allen hurt one season. You're not saying that last year. You're not saying that last year. What the fuck? With Devontae, you're saying that two years ago. Two years ago. Two years ago. One year ago. With who now? You saying that with Devontae? Two years ago now. This year, you gonna say that that motherfucker was good? Hell no! Exactly. Was his team good? No, pretty sure. They got Adam Lazard was the wide oh, receiver oh, oh, one. Oh, oh, oh. Pause, pause. Lazard. How many times are you were telling me they would do nice times, at the beginning of the year? I forget. How many times did Brady right. not have a good team? He's gonna believe in his team. How many times did Brady not have a good team? Very rarely. Like, no, no, no. Yeah, okay. Brady, Brady not, gets stacked teams most of the time. Defense. His defense is crazy. He went to the Bucks. was like the best all around team. Y'all are spinning now. Hold on. Pause. The the offensive options. Bro, but he had Randy Moss, Gronk. At one point. At one point. Uh, that was his fucking. What about who's, who's Rodgers' hey, best Herbo receiver? And he had fucking. Huh? I think Jennings and or Devontae's his best receiver ever, in my opinion. Who? Uh, Rodgers. Rodgers. Yeah. He's had good teams. What? Like what about shit teams. Jordy, Jordy Nelson. Nelson. Jordy this last Nelson year I'll concede, but he's had good teams. Devontae oh is God. nasty though, bro. Devontae is nasty though. Okay, but, but my point is, uh, like, my point Mercedes is, Mercedes Lewis been there his whole career. Too. You can act like this nice. in your, you can act like this when you're fucking winning chips, bro. You're not <laughs> no, in your prime, bro. You, he was an MVP last season. That's not, that's not prime. Two seasons ago. That's okay, because last we're talking about last season before this season coming. You, out, look, you can't, so you, I guess you, you can't drop seasons. off though. Like, you know what I mean? Look, and re, look, if we're being realistic. This was his opportunity to show that uh, it wasn't Devontae Adams. No. This was, facts, was it, dude, this facts. Was his, Did you see their whole offense? It was all passes to Aaron. This is all passes fucking, to Aaron Jones no, and slant routes. No, it was like, opportunity you couldn't go anything show, far. It was an opportunity coach. to show. Okay, that, different dude. offense. Devontae, this nigga was getting triple hold teamed. On, like, on, it's a whole on, different so, story. Okay, you may think that <laughs> Rodgers' uh, success wasn't completely based off of Adams, right? But the question still remains. Was he as good as people thought without Adams? Without a number one receiver. Without a number one. Who would, who would be, though? You think, so would Mahomes be as good without Kelsey? Yeah. I think he still, he lost fucking Tyreek Hill. No, no. Kid. He, he had lost Travis Kelsey. <laughs> he had Travis Kelsey. <laughs> Travis Kelsey. Travis Kelsey. Travis Kelsey. Travis You're, both right. Travis You're both right. You're both right. You're both right. Listen. He lost uh, his biggest, uh, oh, sorry. He lost his biggest option, <laughs> and he fucking won a chip. So I mean, is Tyreek Hill better than Travis Kelsey? You're both right. No, no, I'm not saying Travis that, but Tyreek Hill is better than a lot of the league. What did you say? Tyreek oh, Hill. Oh, for sure. He's top five, for sure. For sure. Uh, exactly. 
So you have a top five. You top five last year too. Kelsey, right? Okay, who's, who's the coach? Five? Kelsey's the best. You're gonna tell me Matt Lafleur is better than what's his... Lafleur? <laughs> Lafleur is better than what's his name? Uh, uh, who's the Chiefs coach? Andy Reid. Lafleur be doing stupid stuff. You see what Andy Reid did to, in the in the Super Bowl? Andy Reid's kind of running in circles around these dudes, bro. Super Bowls, one of few. You're gonna compare those two coaches? Oh, we're not talking about the coaches. We're talking about the players. Oh, you know the coaches matter. You know the coaches matter. Okay, but Patrick Mahomes isn't as good without Andy Reid, in my opinion. I agree, but. Uh, let's compare the two quarterbacks. Who has better mobility right now? Snickers 39. My point. <laughs> that's, that's my point. point. Yeah, the point that's is my he's point. Shit right Don't now. be that's fucking. Arm. You can't be fucking old as well. She's talking about. Hey, Rogers has a better arm. Not right now. Not right now. Not right now. Okay. Prime, I'll give you. Who's the better pocket passer? Yeah, dude. Oh, Mahomes. Darren Darren Mahomes? Who got the better pocket? No, he's talking about he's talking about last year. Last year, Mahomes beat him in every category oh, no. for sure. Who so got the pocket pussy? If he had Devontae Adams, he could be. Oh, no, no, no. Rodgers won every two, No, no, no. Oh, sorry, ago. sorry. No, but last year, or this year, fucking this year, Mahomes won yeah. every yes, two. I, I just had to phrase uh, it correctly. I don't think so. I don't think oh, he didn't get that? No, I don't think it was unanimous. But, okay, no. my point is, uh-huh. if he has a Devontae-type receiver uh-huh. He'll be better. with Garrett Wilson, sure, sure. is it Devontae? But our point is... Okay, let's chill out. Garrett Wilson, nice. No, he's Devontae. supposed to be. Garrett Wilson is going to be nice. He's Devontae, gonna be but he's not Devontae. No, but the, yeah, point, the point is, okay, that when you act that way and you don't have a fucking great amazing season people are gonna fucking so we jump so on we're it. only gonna just we're gonna, are gonna jump on it back one. and you can't just be like oh there's just haters there's just haters no, no I'm not say it's that. for it's the same thing as the Kyrie thing it's the same thing as the Kyrie thing you have all these demands and you haven't won anything with this organization yeah you're what do you mean he's won he's been 13 and 3 for the past three seasons before this one that's winning no but in the playoffs he's choked continuous times it's not even him though the team is choked the team is choked I'll say that the team is choked winning 13 games in the NFL three years in a row is insane I'm not saying that's garbage but I'm just saying he's not like that's he's good. not what he we used to can be. i ask a question that's really not quick? true though because i want to know yes, Gabe. Well, what like, ranking is aaron Rodgers in like top what right now well, quarterback Rogers, wise not ten, team ten, like ten, ten, top, ten. Ten. top 10 so yeah, what a top 10 player the thing about football is because it can change easily within a year you know yeah okay like last Josh year Allen, the, the year he won mvp it was top three so here's the problem drop here's the problem with that shit though like the thing is he's he's a good quarterback he's a top 10 and he every a lot of teams would be lucky to have like they would want him the problem is his age, the amount of money yes, he makes, and yes. it's also the stuff that like comes with him. Demands, yeah, the, the, the demands, off the, off the field stuff. Because you never know when he like could, you know, he's a selfish. But it never affects his in, his play in game. True. Never, or the team that's in the locker room. We haven't heard one negative thing mm-hmm. recently about him. True, said. but the organ it affects the organization, not the players directly. It's but New they York got, though, bro, like. New York, the media is going to kill him before the organization does. Brother. I know, but it's even going to be amplified. So if he ever goes on another darkness retreat or whatever, they're going to yeah. be like, the fuck is he? Especially, comes off a loss, he's like, I'm, I'm, I don't want to talk to the media. They're going to drill him. You know what I mean? That's, uh, that's I mean, but he's never been that type of player to... Do what Zach Wilson did or throw yeah. his teammates under the bus. Okay. Yeah. He's never been that. He's well, always we'll, been we'll like see. straightforward. We'll it's see. Just bad though. It's York, gonna, it's gonna be like he's the, a veteran though. He's been in the league for so long. It's gonna be like the Browns and Watson, like when they gave him a fuck ton of money. I will say this, but I think they're not gonna trade as much though. Thing. That's the good thing about no, the. I understand I the situation. 39, yeah, 60 yeah, yeah. million. Like it's just two, one or two years left. Showing how desperate they are for a quarterback. I'm yeah, yeah. Okay, but the missing piece. No, okay. okay, but the, the Packers it, are showing it's their hand too, because the Packers are not gonna keep them and keep sixty million no, on the books on the just bench. Said we don't give a fuck about you, Bobby bitch. We got love, no, yeah. ready to go. No, he's not gonna play even if he stays on Green Bay, which is obviously probably not gonna happen. No, they said they said about that situation. The thing about this whole thing and the reason I don't think it's happened is because the Packers pretty much said like, yeah, if things go bad, we'll have him back, which basically means like we don't want him. Yeah, and the Jets are like. They're trying to figure out what to give up, and the Jets know that the Packers don't want him, so they're trying to give him. Yeah, as less, less, less you can't keep possible. sixty million on the books, and the locker room is going to be terrible too. That too. Most of the vets on that team are going to side with Rodgers over Love, and like, it's like it's going to be hard for him to go through that leadership type of role for right. Love. It's or, if he's there, or, yeah, yeah probably screwed. Yeah. <laughs> all, all I'm gonna say is, okay, we, can all, we can all agree. We can all agree that the Jets are going to be better than they were with Rodgers. Oh yeah, of course. I think they're going to. That division is going to be tough though. The situation though, him getting there is what like is just weird about it. It's already starting yeah. off weird. Yeah, it's like niggas just go. Like, no, <laughs> it's, like, like it's, it's, so it's not weird. easy like that. Yeah, it's, not the no, it's the whole thing that he's like, like the whole thing. Yeah. Yeah. 
to he's has to get traded. Yeah, yeah has to get, have to figure out what to give out. Give he's going to get. So traded. he has it's to get traded. For, okay, it's a matter of what too. Like how many first rounders? One. Be on the side. I don't think it's going to be any. I think we won. I think it's going to be two second rounders. Like this year's in the future. I don't think it's going to be. You think he's only going to play a season? I think two, and he's done. Oh, Rogers for the Jets. I think two. I can guarantee you it's not going to be a first, just because of if the contract wasn't guaranteed or something, or if they had an out, they would give him a first rounder. But the fact that they have to take that on and they don't really know what he's going to do. That's the why it might not be. It might be a high second or whatever, but I think it'll be one first rounder and then a, a pick that determine like what's like it called swap or whatever. Yeah, an eligibility type of thing. Like yeah. if he plays next year, if they get this to uh, this Compe- compensatory, yeah, pick. compensatory pick. Yeah. So I think that'll be it. But well, the Jets will be better. I think also the leverage thing. They they're gonna be like, why well, would we give you first round pick? You you, you don't want to be or you don't yeah, want him there. 